Hello guys, this video is related for the digital forensic. The digital forensic is something, it's a process of recovering the deleted or lost data which are related to the computer crime. So this can be done by several tools and this video is based on the tool called OTFC forensic tool which is publicly available in the internet. So before using the autopsy forensic tool, it's better to take the original copy of the digital device. Here you can see the process of copying, process of conducting the forensic test. First thing we have need to create an extra copy of the storage device without changing its original. Then we have need to create a new case. So here I am creating a new case. So the case name is I am giving as Russian Tea Room 2 because uh, I am following the case scenario of the Russian Tea Room. So here you can see my path. Here this report is going to save on my documents and autopsy report directory and this name what the name we are going we are giving for this case and then click next and give a case number and give and then give your name that as you are the examiner who is examining this case by using the autopsy tool then it will create a database After created database, you can add data source. Here you can see the list of data source methods. That means uh, these are the methods you can add the data source here. We are already having the disk image for the virtual machine file of the Russian D room case scenario. So I am just going through it. And here you have need to direct the data source for your image file here my image file is cfre ds001 e01 so i have just opened it and i am clicking the next and here you can see the functions which are available by the forensic tool that means autopsy forensic tool and make it at uh, select all and press next And you can see a message data source has been added to the local database files are being analyzed according to the russian droom case study they have given us the image file and they have given the answer of the file that's how it wants to be that how we have need, we need to be recover the details so the things are need things are in the stolen menu are the appetizers soup pancakes meat peas dumplings and so on so uh, we can just copy the text and go to the forensic tool here it is the thing which is added local added to the local database and we can search the thing by typing the keyword so here you can see our search results contain two texts so just click it and you can view the thing this is the actual menu what we need to get out so by this method we can able to retrieve all the stolen menu details by this forensic tool so here i am searching the keyword for soup and it will be available in a one file that's that will be display here and just open it 
and here you can see the soup details so these things are lost and stolen stolen by the thieves in the russian tea shop and they got the pen drive but they can't able to see the actual thing so they have went for a forensic test and this is the forensic test done by us to retrieve the image the thing is you have need to retrieve all the things as like this appetizers soup this is a sample output they have given in the case study to be get as an output of us the manual documentation is you can be able to get from my website this is the link for that website so you can follow it and if you have any questions you can ask by commenting below to that blog thank you